G'day. Could privacy be the next big business model? G'day, g'day, g'day. I heard an interesting conversation the other day with The Woz, Steve Wozniak, who of course was the co-founder of Apple. And he was talking about all the issues around Facebook and all of those issues concerning privacy. And what he said was that he would pay to use a service that was otherwise free just for the comfort and security of knowing that his data wasn't being shared with advertisers and the Cambridge Analyticas of this world. And I think it's a really valid point because we often complain about how our social network feeds are bombarded by ads, but of course, by and large, we're not being charged to use these services. And so we know that we're gonna get flooded with ads, yet it still frustrates us. And I actually think that if I had the option to pay a reasonable, nominal, smallish monthly fee to use Facebook and know that my ads weren't gonna, sorry, that my data was not gonna be shared with advertisers, I reckon I'd actually pay for it. It's very similar to the way a lot of the apps work in the app stores these days where they'll give you a free version of the game or the tool, but they'll flood it with ads. And if you want the ads removed, then you need to pay for the service. So I think if these social networks were maybe to consider positioning that revenue as for privacy only, then I reckon they might actually have some people subscribe. I reckon it could be a nice way to maybe substitute their revenue. And for those that aren't concerned and don't want to pay, maybe they are concerned, but they don't want to pay, then they just have to deal with the fact that advertisers are going to get their information and going to serve ads to them. What do you reckon? If you had the choice of paying for a Facebook or an Instagram subscription that was ad free, would you pay? And if so, how much would you pay? Let me know. I'd love to hear about it. Alrighty. Thanks for tuning in. I will be back again tomorrow. See ya.